Hi, 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 and welcome to 12 Days of Creativity, the music production challenge where I make a track in 12 steps and I challenge you to do as well. So, day nine, lifts, drops, swells, fills, transitions, impact, every detail that makes your track come alive and makes it super interesting. Let's go. So we can start with the low impact hits. This is an aspect that I really can't do tracks without because they just make any track sound amazing. So in this step one, I created these cool impact hits using contact. Something strange happens. So firstly, I'm gonna just put them into the Something track and the intro. Happens. I like the cinematic vibe that they're giving. And next, I'm gonna just go to the samples area of the browser. And literally, I'm just gonna look for samples with the search term boom and impact. I'm gonna drop them into transitions. The so example, just before the gap or just after the gap. The So I'm looking for samples with lot of impact, long decay. And in this point, I'm just shamelessly just dropping them everywhere, finding which one fits where and also looking for new ones. I love this one, very deep. And this one is more like a basic one, super cinematic. So some of the stuff I also put in the middle of the choruses to kind of separate the sections and add info. So not only on the transitions, but also in the middle of sections. I find this amazing also in the intro. And because I like it in the intro, I actually like it more than the impact hits. So I'm gonna replace them with that. So instead of an impact now, we're gonna focus on the transitional smoothness. So I'm gonna go back to some of the samples I created for when I was making an this album in seven days. They are hi-hat, snare and cymbal sounds with the long, long, long decays and a lot of reverb. So I reverse them and put them in the drops. From those files, I actually found some more impacts that have a lot more decay as well. So I'm just going to add a couple of those here. I especially like this one because the pitch drops in it. So it's perfect for a transition like this where it's a quietness and it kind of bass drops and then we continue. So I'm also adding some decay to the end of the song. And also, I'm going to actually reverse it back and I'm going to create a swoosh. So we have a swelling sound coming in and swoosh going out. Add in these high end sounds as well as low end sounds, reverse, long decay, FX. Everywhere in the song just adds instant quality to your song. Honestly, try this out. It's just going to make it sound so much better. Hello, the daily thoughts. <laughs> okay, today's thought is you are not always responsible of your creativity. We can put our creative workflows into two or three sections. Divergent thinking, convergent thinking and learning. So learning is quite self-explanatory. It's where you learn. Wow, I was just advertising the boat company accidentally there. <laughs> um, so you know where to come when you come and be a tourist in York. So divergent thinking is where we just let the creativity flow through us without judgment, just let it go. Convergent thinking is where we take those ideas and we make it something, something like a song. Yeah, structural. So the thought is you can't always be in charge of your divergent thinking. Don't be so harsh. Just accept the thoughts that come through you and also the outcome. You might not like the outcome right now of your song. I always use this as an example. We all used to hate 80s, 80s music, 80s fashion, and looks what's fashionable now. You know, our perspectives and our thoughts change, we change. So who are you to judge what sounds good and what doesn't? So who are you to judge if your track is good or not? And on this note, please submit your songs to this uh, maker of the month, maker, maker of the month, month. Thing. You know, if you feel like, oh no, it's not, I'm not a proper producer, oh no, I'm not, it's not gonna be great, it's just a couple of samples. Just so, still send it. 
still isn't it? Just be kind to yourself, that's the point. Be kind to yourself, sit with music, and also let's be, let, let's be less judgmental for others as well, for ourselves and others. Bye.